Hey guys, on today's video I'm going to teach you how to update your iPhone, iPad or Touch to the latest iOS. So let's just go right into your settings. Now under your settings, what you guys should do, the very first thing, right up here you guys will see your name. In there it's iCloud. So just make a backup on your iCloud just in case something goes wrong. If there's no more space on your iCloud, just like it happens to me all the time, just hook it up to your computer, use iTunes which is a free program for both Mac and PC and just make your backup there, it's unlimited. So. Once you guys do that, scroll down, you guys will see general. Under general, you guys will see your second option where it says software update. So let's just click there. You guys should see this. Now, some of you may see install right away and not the download option. Well, that's okay. It just means it downloaded by itself. It's only 64 megabytes after all. So that's only going to take a couple minutes. And for most of you, this will install really, really fast. So you guys are looking at five minutes in total. If your iPhone, iPad, or Touch are really slow, yes, this could take a little bit longer. So you're looking max 30 minutes, but that's really, really slow. That means your internet speed's really slow. Something's maybe something really sketchy going on with your iPhone, iPad, or Touch, and that's why it's running so slow. But other than that, this shouldn't take that long. So let's just tap on download. Now you guys do need at least 50% of your battery. And even if you guys do have 50% of your battery, I still recommend having it hooked up to some electricity so you guys are good to go. Now let's say you guys don't see this update. Remember I mentioned iTunes? Yes, iTunes on your computer. Just hook up your iPhone, iPad Touch to your computer and just update it through iTunes, okay? If you guys don't see this update. If you guys have an older iPad, let's say an iPad 2, and you're stuck in iOS 9, well, there's really nothing you guys can do. Don't fall for any scams that you guys see online where they tell you that you guys can update. You can't, you're really stuck with older devices such as an iPad 2, which is stuck at iOS 9. So there's really no way to update it. And if you guys know that you guys have a newer iPhone, even iPhone 6, for example, that is compatible with iOS 12, such as this version, then yes, hook it up to your iTunes if you guys don't see it here and just do that update. Again, iTunes is free for Windows, PCs, and Macs, all right? Anyways, guys, what you guys will see once this installs is restarting, okay? So you guys will see a black screen, white screen, Apple logo, loading bar, and that's it. It's just gonna load once, it's gonna restart, and that's it. It's not gonna ask you for your Apple ID again. It will ask you for your passcode if you guys do have one in order to enter your iPhone, iPad, or Touch, but that's it. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.